Hey there, so today we have another review and this is another one from Wanderment Brewing. Uh, thank you so much to John. And this is his Lemongrass Lemon Peel Mixed Culture Saison. Um, right? Yeah, or ale. What do we want to call it? I will try to read a little bit more about the scripture after I dig into it. This one was actually bottled about six months ago. Yeah, let's go something like that. So, whereas the other one was like a year old or uh, 11 months old. Again, not, not an issue. Like it's uh, bottle conditioned, really let the Brett kind of attack everything. So, uh, similar kind of color. I assume it's similar kind of base beer, light straw color, wonderful, kind of like wonderful white head. Yeah, pretty good head. Yeah, nice. Oh, yeah. So, this one to me is a little bit more dirty. Um, the first one was more acidic. Yeah. This one, the Brett has really gotten a little bit more showy. It shows this kind of like um, sweat, yeah, sweaty sock thing. Mm -hmm. With a nice kind of acidity in there, but yeah. Way more like. Yeah, more funky. Leaning towards like blue cheese kind of thing, like all that kind of character. Cheers. Mm. Nice. So I would argue relatively kind of similar character. Uh, this one for me snaps up a little bit more acidic. Sort of get the acidity riding a little bit more on the back end and it sort of puckers on the back end. Lemongrass, lemon peel. Yeah. So I think maybe the lemon peel is accentuating the acidity. But I can't imagine lemon peel is actually out offering any actual acid. So something about it's like pretty nice. Like again, I wouldn't not go that. Not, now now that I uh, drink more, there's this kind of nice kind of green herbal, uh, lemongrassy character to it. Mm. I feel lemon peel might be playing a great job at like bridging those flavors of the acidity of the uh, beer and just like bumping it up a little bit more. So before I was getting this kind of like, nice kind of like generic kind of lemon lime kind of thing, just um, uh, lactic acidity here. It's like more specifically lemon, right? So now it's like, tastes like you squeeze a little bit of lemon juice in here. <laughs> the funk is quite nice. I like the crackery malt in here. I feel like it doesn't have that emptiness that I was getting. Uh, in the last beer, so maybe that beer had the THP and this one didn't, I don't know. This one has a nice car, there's more kind of just like lingering flavor of beer. There's more lemon, there's more malt, there's more funkiness that sort of shows up uh, driving here. This one I definitely prefer. Um, yeah, no, no question. Let's uh, dig into what they have to say. So fourth version of his mixed culture beer. Uh, Reviewed the third version last year. Okay, so I'll have to link that, find that. Uh, the lavender, oh, so. So lemongrass and lemon peel are added near the end of the boil. He uses mitofoy, uh, sorry, halatal mitofoy. Um, Amarillo lemon drama to wake up, small dry hop. Similar, he does the, uh, so obviously these are similar beers in the sense that standard French plus Belgian um, saison strains. Goes to one Plato, as his house uh, strain of, you know, mixed cultures, bacterias, blah, blah, similar process. But, hmm, I don't know. I just like this one more. I don't know what to say. The bright character I definitely prefer. I like where the acidity hits. It seemed, and it seemed just like more complete of beer. So uh, this one's absolutely fantastic, yeah. Again, I would go Jolly Pumpkin with this kind of stuff. Mm. Yeah, that's way better. Uh, let's go with Solid. 96, 96. This one's solidly better. I like it. Uh, I think it just, I mean, I really like the uh, lavender quality of the last beer, but this one, you know, whatever despite adjunct of uh, lemongrass or um, lemon peel, I think it's just a better kind of package of the Brett character, the Sydney, the complete package of the beer where the malt hits. And... Mm. Like this is, yeah, definitely more drinkable. So that maybe leads me to believe that THP was the last beer. I don't know, who knows? But post the comments below if you know about THP. Uh, this one's really quite tasty. Again, commercial quality beer. 
if you know someone you know wants to, wants a bottle share and give me one of these i'd be like very happy about it because i am uh, you're generally tasting all the sweet hoppy not even happy anymore sweet 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 <laughs> beers uh fruity blah blah like this is a nice kind of just like pretty cut uh i would love this for some food so that's a nice thing guys cheers later